Hey, how's it? This is the foundation coming at you with a free training camp video. Um, you know, not too, not too much, you know, like, you know, not to overhype it or anything like that. But, you know, I also always see the importance of of training camp, you know, preseason games like that. Um, especially with the uncertainty with our, with our um, defensive line. Uh, the 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 suspension is what it is already uh, a couple times I said what I needed to say but you know like there's also there's also the, the, the young guys and new guys that we got um, Charles Tapper again is my diamond in the rough um, Benson Mayowa uh, you know I, I think that I think that he could be a good contributor uh, Ryan Russell uh, just because of the you know the praise that he got you know see if that he can you know being being uh, being a whole year now getting his second year in you know see what he can do uh, might also another uh, dark horse that I think can make a big impact on our team is uh, David Irving so you know and seeing how Cedric Thornton gels with our defensive line uh, Tyron Crawford you know the, well Crawford and Crawford, but Tyrone Crawford more um, having having that shoulder sur uh, shoulder surgery. You know, he basically was playing with one arm last year. See see how he plays. See how much how much more of an impact he can make as far as uh, you know as far as being 100% healthy. You know, having those having the the linebacking core bringing back the Rand, seeing who's the best combination out there. See which guy was going to be the uh, best combination. Also with uh, Scandrick coming back healthy, you know, making, you know, providing stability to the cornerbacks, you know, and then leaving um, Byron Jones to to really concentrate on on being that free safety that 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 we need. And you know, from what I what I would read from the from the Cowboy Riders and what they tell the coaches say that his his mentality his um, knowledge of the game is almost as good as uh, Sean Lee so you know that's a big compliment you know Sean Lee is a very very cerebral uh, player you know as well as being talented so you know with, guy, with, with guys like that then you know I really I really looking forward to seeing that uh, the competition between Bryce Butler uh, which everybody's kind of hyping up um, to Terrence Williams Terrence Williams I think still is the better second second receiver option uh, the reason why I like Terrence Williams because he's just so healthy so reliable um, also he's been very clutch you know that that Sandlot player like when 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 you least expect it I mean you know when not when you least expect it but when something just comes out of anywhere he always seems to pop up in that kind of things you know um, seeing our seeing our, um, our off, you know our second year players like Lucky Whitehead how are they gonna expand and utilize him um, in his second year knowing that he, he, he has potential to be a, a real playmaker um, also also like you know um, also, Lyle Collins really settling into his uh, left guard position, uh, the left guard position, and you know we we've been um, dubbed the best defense, I mean offensive line in the league. What I want now is you know this to be like how um, the Great Wall of Dallas, the the prior, you know the you know probably the greatest offensive lineman line of all time, you know strike fear into into defenses now, you know, like. Man, we gotta play against these, these guys. You know, it, it, it's gonna be. It, it, that's what I want. That's what. That's what it would like. Bring a, give us a mental edge over a lot of teams. Defense. I mean, de a lot of defenses, I should say. And also, you know, um, Chaz Green, um, basically being injured, getting the surgery. Uh, the big question is, is that who can be our swing tackle, uh, or can he? Can he, can he, um, 
can he take the job from Doug Free? And also, you know, and either also, you know, um, not worry. Not worry when, if, if like, let's say, um, let's say Doug Free goes down, we don't have to shuffle the line. We just plug, plug Chaz Green in. I know we got a couple other guys, but, you know, he's a, he, he's a guy that we can look in at and, you know, all that. Uh, also, yeah, that, yeah, that's the things that I really look forward to. It's, it's not all, the thing that we, you want to know is like how much, how much of the gap between your question, between the questions of your team is, is it, is it, um, is it a big gap or is it fixable? And we can answer, I mean, those can, questions can be answered, you know, like, uh, Dak Prescott, you know, uh, a full season now with, um, uh, Kellen Moore. Can Dex Prescott like show us a flash of what the years can come? Like, okay, good. We don't have to. We don't have to dra uh, draft another quarterback in the future. We can. We can put him in when eventually Romo does retire and all that. But that's the things I really look forward to, and you know. But that yeah, that's about it. Uh, more videos to come about you know training camp starts Thursday so you're gonna see more videos now that the season starting to really come into play um, yeah so mahalo for watching you know all boys go Cowboys <laughs>